Hello everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to a RuneScape Max Stats thing. I'm still tired. Uh, uh, yeah, so this week and stuff, I didn't upload that many videos. Actually, I didn't upload any videos this week. Um, but I wanted to get this one in on the Monday. And I think Mondays might be the new day for that, because I don't play really any RS3 anymore, so the news things have kind of stopped with that. I don't know. Maybe I'll start up with that again. I don't, I'm not really sure, but like two memberships is not really something that I can uh, go ahead and start to afford. Uh, right now, uh, so yeah, maybe in the future, we'll see what happens, but either way, it was Black Friday week, uh, so preparation for that, and of course Black Friday over the weekend, I work retail, uh, so that's why I really haven't, uh, been on, it's just I've been really busy, and i maybe gotten in a few hours every day really in, so I, those few hours, I really wanted to be, you know, nose to the grindstone grind, um, doing Slayer and, uh, and training at my combats and stuff like that, so, uh, last time I had... I was working on strength. I was almost 275. Uh, I have gotten that 75, and I'm now working on attack uh, 280, and I'm at 79, but 50k uh, to 80, so that's pretty sweet. Uh, I'm going to go for defense next to get that to 80, just so I don't have to switch out my whip, and then I'll uh, worry about strength to 80 after that. Once I have 80 all for those, I'm probably going to slack off on combat a little bit for a little while and work on some skills and stuff just to get some of those up. Um, you know, get uh, Hunter up to that 50 mark at least that I wanted to be at. Uh, I'll probably work on uh, runecrafting again as well. Maybe get that to 40, just have that on a nice even uh, number. 36 just looks really ugly. Uh, farming, I'll probably do actual some farm runs and some actual runs. I may try to get to 25 and do Garden of Tranquility. Um... Once I get around to uh, to doing that, so yeah, I kind of want to work on some skills and stuff and just get them up. Agility probably get to, to 65, 70, which is going to be painful, but you know it's something that has to be done. And you know, 70 does unlock some really better shortcuts and whatnot for the skill. So you know, it's it's beneficial to uh, to do. Uh, I'm also looking at getting 70 cooking. I have the lobster still in my bank. I just you know got 66 and just boosted for the RFD part that I needed, so I'll probably just, uh, you know, cook all those off and get that 70, uh, just to get that out of the way, um, and yeah, I don't know what other skills I'll probably end up doing, God knows, you know, I'll probably do a bunch of crafting, get that a bit higher, um, I don't think it's high enough uh, right now, and there's some, you know, decent ways and decent profitable ways to uh, get up crafting uh, early on, stuff like, you know, like, um, battle staves and whatnot so you know we'll uh i'll figure it out either way we'll uh, figure out what skills i really want to do but uh yeah i've been working mostly on combat for the past week because it's been easy it's afkable for the most part uh slayer has been a big focus as you can see 67 to 70 almost 71 very slow skill i forgot how slow slayer actually is in old school like in uh, rs3 for example like it's not a slow skill really it's slower than other skills for that's definitely for sure. You're still probably going to get most of your 99 melee combats, uh, probably um, one of the non melees like major range, probably range because it's more commonly used. But anyway, you're probably going to get those out of Slayer still before you get 99. Um, and I did for the most part. Uh, I started a bit late, so it's why I don't have all those 99s. But pretty much if you combat straight from level 1 to 99 Slayer, and that's all you do for combat, you're going to have 99s in the mid 90s of, of Slayer. So. You know, but I forgot how slow it was here. It's considerably slower, and I'm hoping it speeds up a little bit, and I imagine it will once you hit uh, the Slayer monsters really worth a damn, and once you have the combats to really uh, go after them. So stuff like, you know, Abbey Demons, Necreals, uh, Gargoyles would be nice. I think they're 75, I believe. Um, so those, those will be nice now that they've been buffed. So yeah, yeah, 75 for Gargoyles, so... 70 is cure asks, which I haven't got a task for that yet. I've only done two, three tasks. I think it's 70, so I guess I really shouldn't expect it. But one task I haven't gotten at all, and I'm kind of surprised that I haven't uh, throughout the entire one, because it seems to be a common one for just about everybody else, is Ankus. I don't know why I haven't gotten any Ankus tasks, but it's popular for literally everybody but me, and I don't know why I haven't gotten one. Uh, not that I'm overly complaining. Ankus are not a really profitable task. They're okay training, but they're not a great profitable task. But they were always a popular one uh, for pretty much everybody else, and they were a popular one for me in RS3 as well when I was starting to train up Slayer uh, there. So I I'm surprised that, you know, it, it, I, it, I haven't gotten it at all here. It's it's weird. 
But uh, I'm pretty happy with Dust Devils, though. I've been getting Dust Devils quite uh, often, and, like, they're a pretty good, profitable task. Like, you're looking at, you know, multiple Mystic Earth and Mystic uh, Air Staffs. You're looking at a shit ton of runes. Um, possibility for a D-Chain, of course, which will never happen. I already got that. I had a, I got a Vizzy drop um, about uh, two weeks ago, so I, I, my RNG is probably out of fucking whack right now for that. But, you know, they drop, like, noted Addy Bars, uh, Soul Runes, Chaos Runes, shit tons of fucking fire, dust for some reason, which, you know, eh, it's fine. It's, dusts are fairly useful. Um, Earth Runes, you know, they, they drop quite a bit of stuff. D Dragon Daggers now, because I think they got buffed to drop those on a rare occasion, and, you know, I've gotten, like, 10, 12 of those. So, you know, it's not... Um, they're not too bad of a task, honestly. Like, they're pretty good. I, and training's not bad either. Like, they're decent XP... Like, I'm raking in something like probably like about 50, 60k an hour uh, here, something like that. Um, so, this they're not bad. They're really not bad. Uh, good task. I'm glad that I'm getting them on the regular now. Um, because, like, it, it breaks up the shit tasks. Like, trolls. Like, trolls are awful. I had those. I actually uh, accidentally uh, kind of half AFK'd one of those because I got called upstairs. And I came back and I was dead because I got lured into the. Um, the stupid thrower trolls, and even with, like, bandos and shit, those things hit like trucks, so I was dead before I even thought about, you know, what I had done, and I had to go back and get my shit again, and, yeah, so it was just a shitty task, and I, I just don't like trolls, they're fucking awful, but Dust Devils, I'll get them all day, hell yeah, all day long, um, pretty damn good, so hopefully more tasks like that in the future, I'd like to get a cuirass task and just do those and see what those are really like. Uh, I haven't killed those yet, but I know they had a buff on their drop table, so it'd be nice to kind of kill those and maybe get a leaf bladed battle axe. That'd be kind of sweet too, you know. But uh, yeah, uh, other than that though, guys, that's pretty much all I've been doing this week, and yeah, it's just rambling on at this point. So thank you very much for watching, and I will see you all next time. Peace.